All right, what's going on guys? T. Torres back here for another video. We have a very uh, exciting video today. I'm gonna be uh, surprising my buddy uh, Ben with a new uh, rear shock for his Grom. He has a 2022 Honda Grom SP and uh, he helped me with my cam. And I couldn't have asked, uh, I, get, I couldn't think, uh, thank him enough. So big shout out to uh, Scooter Works for sending this uh, shock out and all the, all the people that I have that follow me in the Grom community. If you're interested in the same shock, I'll have a link down in the description to their website. To where you can get the same one so let's go ahead and take a look at the uh, shock so off the bat they sent me a nice t-shirt thank you they sent me some uh, little pins and then here you have it here is the uh, the actual shock itself and i am curious to see how this is going to compare to the uh, yss and then the hyper pro one i have so uh, we're going to throw it on his bike i should be able to get this done in about 20 minutes or so and uh, yeah we'll see what ben says on how this feels uh, over the uh over the factory one and uh, i'm about to head over to his house now and surprise him with the uh with this new shot man thanks ben uh for helping me with my cam let's get this bad boy on your bike all right we just got to uh ben's house i'm gonna let him see what i got him yeah i've been interested in this i need to get the front done now though yep i got you a uh i got you a rear shot big oh. shout out to scooter works they uh provided that for us so uh Let's get that puppy. Nothing like a late Christmas gift. That's right. All right, man. Let's get this thing on the uh, on the bike. So Ben's already got the bike all um, set up because, of course, you know, uh, I've made many install videos about this. You have to have the rear tire off the ground to uh, relieve the uh, compression off the shock. So open that thing up. Let's see what it looks like, man. Once again, big shout out to Scooter Works for sending this out. If you're interested in this shock, we will have a link down in the description, and once we get done installing it, Ben's gonna take it for a ride and see what he thinks over the uh, over the factory uh, shot compared to the uh, compared to the new one. So, all right, let's get to uh, tearing this bike down. And uh, yep. All right, so we're starting to uh, strip down the bike. Uh, Ben's gonna have to remove the uh, Yosh exhaust to get this uh, the rear plastic uh, fender off. Unlike my bike, I had enough room in between the exhaust and that that little Allen. To get it off but in the meantime i'm gonna show you this while he does that he also has a brand new 450 rl but it's also been on the channel <clears throat> and then he has one of my favorite he has a pretty sweet uh, uh monkey as well and then it, what does your son have uh 125 he's got a brand his son has a brand new 125 he's out he's out hanging out with his grandparents riding it as well so ben definitely has a garage a garage full of bikes so i'll update you guys in just a minute all right, so the NYC shock is now on Ben's Grom. Here is the uh, first look of it installed. It probably took us maybe 10, 15 minutes to disassemble and take the take the old one out. If you ask me, in my opinion, I think the black looks a lot better than the actual yellow shock itself. So we're gonna finish putting all the pieces uh, back onto the bike, and then we're gonna let Ben take it for a ride and see what he thinks on how the shock feels over the uh, over the standard stock shock. Okay. All right, we're putting the uh, final touches back on, getting everything reassembled. Got the rear fender guard back on, got the yoke back on, got the springs back on. Everything's tight on the shock. Uh, covers back on. All he's got to do is finish tightening that down. Give me another 12 when you get a second tire. All right. Okay, so after he gets done tightening down the yoke, we're going to put the seat back on, release it from the hook, and uh, yeah, we'll take it for its main and voyage, and we'll see what Ben thinks about it. I'm going to ride it down the street my, myself and see how it compares to the YSS and the, uh, the Hyper Pro that I have. So once again, uh, this is the show it to you. DNCY New Motorsports uh, Shop. And once again, big thanks to, uh, to them for uh, sending this out and uh, very, very much appreciated. Let me see if I can zoom in. There you go. There's the part number for you guys. Like I said, I'll have the exact link down in the description if you're interested in getting in this uh, this uh, same shot. All right, Ben, go ahead and sit on it for the first time and see how it feels over the factory one. Oh wow, a lot better. I mean, that's I mean the front still mushy as it can be, but that back that's completely different. It takes the whole like when I first put mine on, it takes the whole squishy. Oh yeah, like they're usually it's, yeah, that's way different now. You can just feel it. Yeah, fire that thing up and take it down the street. Let's see what Let's you think. See what it does. Here we go. I can 
can definitely tell from his face that he he definitely liked it. Here we go. There's my baby shining. Yes, sir. Thing look good, boy. All right, he's headed down the road, and uh, safe to say, I think he's. I think he definitely likes it. After him sitting on it for the first time and seeing his reaction, he definitely, definitely did a good job. So thank you, Scooter Works, for sending this out. And I can't mention this enough. Thank you, thank you, thank you. And if you guys are interested in the same shot, I have a link down in the description. I'm gonna ride the bike uh, whenever he gets done, and uh, we'll see how it compares to the uh, YSS and the Hyper Pro. I'm sure it's gonna be all, all within the uh, same feels of the uh, of the ones that I have on the bike. So let's capture him riding back down for the first time. Get his reaction. Here he comes. It's, it's much sharper. Yeah, it's a lot better? Yeah, I mean, it rides a lot better. I can see how he probably used it on the front to really get the full, you know, probably maximum enjoyment out of it oh yeah it's much sharper on a, on a scale of better. one to ten you ain't got to rate it the highest because it's free but what, what do you give it you know man i'd like to rate it after i had the front suspension put on with it but just doing this i'd say as far as mods go and actually know noticing a difference in eight and eight and then so just like myself we're both over 200 pounds mm -hmm, i'm 230 so you can't say that that doesn't feel no, way, way better than the factory you know if somebody really light i mean it might not be as big a difference but yeah and, and you know it's like Sometimes you're just in the back, you'll notice you hit those little bumps a little bit and it just kind of bottoms out. It's kind of rough. I'm sure it's not going to do that anymore. Right, right. All right, I'm going to take it for a spin and I'm going to see how it feels. Yeah, go right in. Okay, somehow the final footage of the video that I took with Ben uh, messed up. So it was pretty much just Ben was saying thank you for the Christmas gift, blah, blah, blah. blah. I took the bike for a ride and I'd say, you know, it rides as as equivalent to the YSS. Um, I think the Hyper Pro, it's it's as stiff, but it's a little bit smoother, if that uh, if that makes sense. But nonetheless, the the shock that, that we that I gave Ben is is a great shock. And um, he was happy he was happy with it and um, <laughs> I feel very confident in changing out the rear shocks. So I think it's the third one I've done on a Honda Gram. But anyways, thank you all so much for watching and Ben uh, once again Thank you for helping me uh, with the cam install and uh, this little, just want to show you, uh, you know, a little appreciation for hooking you up with that rear shot, man. So if you guys are subbing to the channel for, for the first time, please hit the subscribe button, turn on your post notifications, and I'll catch y'all in the next video. Peace.